<laughs> Olivia, what are we going to draw in this lesson? A walking leaf. Yeah, a leaf bug. Yeah. We, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you're going to follow along with us. One of our favorite cartoons is what? What's um, our favorite cartoon? Bluey. Yeah, Bluey. And we love the episode that has the walking leaf in it. Mm -hmm. So we thought it would be fun to draw one. We hope you're going to follow along with us. What do we need for this lesson? Crayons. Crayons and? Paper. Paper. And we're going to use a green crayon, yellow, and also, what color is this? Um, black. Yeah, black. We're first going to use our green crayon. We're going to draw the eye for our walking leaf. We're going to draw a circle. Do you want to draw a circle right here? Yes, good job. Oh, I like that shape. <laughs> Then we're going to draw the leaf shape, and this one's a little tricky, but we're going to use points to help us. We'll put one point in front of the eye. Put a point right there. Good job. Then we're going to do another dot back here for the back of our leaf. We'll put it right here towards the top of our paper. Put it right about here. Little dot. Yeah. Now we're going to draw the top of our leaf, and we're going to draw a big rainbow line that starts here on this point. And we're going to draw a curve, it comes up, and then back down. Oh, I went past the dot. That's okay. okay. So we're going to draw a big rainbow line, comes up, and then touch the point. Ah, that's perfect. Now we're going to draw the bottom of our leaf, and we're going to do the same thing. We'll start over here. We'll draw a curve, it comes under, and then touches the second point. Two dots. One, two. <laughs> I like the shape of your leaf. You did it. You're a great artist. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to color our leaf green, the whole thing, except we're going to leave our eyes white. Mm -hmm. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. That was a lot of coloring, and you did a great job, and you left the eye white. Mm -hmm. Now you guys can pause the video if you need extra time at home. Mm -hmm. All right. What's our leaf bug missing? Our um, walking leaf. Legs. Yeah, legs. Lots of legs. Mm -hmm. Let's draw three. We're going to draw one line, two, and then three. Do you want to draw three lines coming mm -hmm. down from the bottom? One, two, three. I like Either your legs. Those are big legs. I want to make my legs as big as yours. There's three big legs. Insects usually have six, but we're going to leave it just like that to keep the lesson simple and easy. Now we need to switch to our black crayon because we need to add the eye. Let's draw a little circle right here inside of the white circle. A little circle. What is our leaf bug missing? A mouth. A mouth. Yeah, let's draw a happy leaf bug walking leaf. Draw a little smile right here. Oh. It's perfect. All right, now let's switch to our yellow crayon and we're going to add a line from the eye all the way back to the point. And if this doesn't show up, we can go over it a couple times and make it stronger. Mm -hmm. Now let's add a big line that goes from the middle to the outside. So you can do one right here, go all the way right here up to the top. Then we're going to do one that comes down on the bottom. This makes it look even more like a leaf. The lines inside of the leaf. And then let's add another one on top. And then we can add another one on the bottom. And then we're going to add one more little one at the very end of our leaf right here. And then one last little one at the very bottom, just like we did on the top. See how we added three lines on the top and three lines on the bottom. Do you want to add one more line to the bottom right here? We did it. We finished drawing our walking leaf. And you did such a great job. I love that our drawings look different. Yours turned out so cute. Did you have fun? Yeah. And we hope you had a lot of fun following along with us. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye. 
Hey parents and teachers, take a photo of your child's finished artwork and post it on Facebook or Instagram. Also be sure to tag us in it at Art for Kids Hub. Did you know that we also have a website? You can find it at artforkidshub.com. It has more lessons and information about art supplies we love to use. You can also visit artforkidshub.tv to learn more about our awesome Art Hub membership. The membership includes exclusive lessons and our own apps so your child can learn art in a focused, distraction-free environment.